Hello guys! Welcome back to my channel. It's me again, Lakwat Serong Butike. Mula doon sa makasaysayang simbahan ng Apalit Pampanga, ang St. Peter the Apostol Parish o mas kilala sa pangalan na Apalit Church, nakatawid na ako ngayon dito sa makasaysayan rin na simbahan ng Makabebe Pampanga, ang San Nicolas di Tulentino Parish o mas tanyag sa pangalan na Makabebe Church. Samahan niyo ako dito guys! The municipality of Makabebe is a first-class municipality in the province of Pampanga. According to the 2020 census, it has a population of 78,151 people. Makabebe, an ancient town in the modern-day province of Pampanga, is intimately linked to the Pampanga River. The town was named Makabebe because it is geographically situated along the shores or banks of Rio Grande de Pampanga. The town is sometimes referred to as Makabebe because of the abundance of corals and shells along the Rio Grande in earlier times. The Makabebes were the first Kapampangans to appear in European recorded history. In the Spanish colonial period, of the Philippines, Makabebe was considered one of the oldest and most important communities of Pampanga. The ancient town of Makabebe owes its importance to its location along the Rio Grande de la Pampanga. The river's routes and its northern tributaries provided the pathways to the early major settlements in Pampanga. The English translation of Makabebe, meaning surrounded by rivers, describes the historical heritage of the ancient town. The Makabebe dialect is said to be harsher and louder than others due to how the townspeople communicate across the river. The Pampanga River is of great importance to Makabebe. Fishing is still a major source of sustenance and income for its residents. A number of fisheries can be found along the river. The province of Pampanga is also the traditional homeland of the Kapampangan people. The Kapampangan of Makabebe had played a dynamic and at times conflicting role in the history of the Philippines. They fought against the Spanish in 1571 such as the case when the youthful Tariq Suleiman or Bambalito became the first Kapampangan and Filipino martyr who fought against Spanish rule. They also defended the last Spanish garrison against revolutionaries in 1898. The services of the Makabebes led to the naming of a street in Spain's capital city of Madrid, in their honor, Calle de Voluntarios Macabebes. The Kapampangans of Macabebe were also allies of Imperial Spain when the Dutch invaders tried to colonize the Philippines. They fought together with the Spaniards to protect the islands from its invaders, and in return, only the Kapampangan is allowed to study in prominent exclusive schools and universities run by the Spaniards. In 1901, American General Frederick Funston and his troops captured Philippine President 
Emilio Aguinaldo in Palanan, Isabela, with the help of some Kapampangans, later called the Makababy Scouts, after their home local who had joined the Americans' side. The Americans pretended to be captives of the Makabebes, who were dressed in Philippine Army uniforms. Once Fanstone and his captors entered Aguinaldo's camp, they immediately apprehended Aguinaldo and his men. During World War II, Japanese fighter and bomber planes air raided the municipalities of Makabebe in December 1941. Makabebe was subsequently occupied by the Japanese Imperial Army in 1942. Makabebe is located in the southern part of Pampanga. It is bordered to the north by the municipalities of Minalin, Guagua, and Apalit. To the east by the municipalities of Calumpit and Hagunoy in Bulacan. To the west by the municipality of Sasmuan and to the south by the municipality of Masantol and Manila Bay. Some notable personalities. J. Sonza, Filipino journalist and politician. Vicente Manansala, national artist for painting, 1981. And Mark Makapagal, Filipino, former PBA player, Barangay Ginebra Kings, and Miralco Bolts. San Nicolas de Tolentino Parish, commonly referred to as Makabebe Church, is a 17th century Baroque church located at Barangay Santa Cruz, Makabebe, Pampanga. The parish church, under the patronage of St. Nicholas of Tolentin, is under the Roman Catholic Archdiocese of San Fernando. Augustinian friars established the early Catholic community of Makabebe on March 3, 1575, as a visita or sub-parish of the nearby parish of San Juan Bautista, Calumpit. Later the same year, Father Sebastian de Molena was named chaplain of the Makabebe. On September 6, 1576, the administration of the church and convent of Makabebe was transferred to San Agustin Parish of Lubao, with Father Eldefonso Heredero as administrator. The first church structure believed to have been erected between 1576 and 1583 is attributed to Father Heredero. The exact date of the construction of the present masonry church is not specified although it has been documented that Father Felipe Taliada priest of Makabebe in 1613, reinforced the church with stronger materials. Father Tomas Gresa expanded the church in 1864. Finally, the church was completed in 1880 under the administration of Father Eleuterio Ibias. Two major events of the late 19th century damaged the stone and brick church. The earthquakes of 1880 and the Philippine Revolution of 1898 wherein the church purportedly was set on fire by the revolutionaries under the order of General Isidoro Torres in fury of the Filipino revolutionaries for the locals' loyalty to Spain and subsequently to the Americans. Post-war renovation works were undertaken afterwards. The facade of the church is of barn-style Baroque architecture with predominantly neoclassical features. It is bare of ornamentation save for coupled Ionic 
pilasters located on the two levels of the facade. The entire front is caped by a triangular pediment adorned by a rectangular saint's niche. The monotony of neoclassical features is broken by the complex carvings on the topmost level of the three-tired belfry attached to the right of the structure. Also, adding to the contrast are the two large wooden images and floral designs each on the main door. The church measures 70 meters long, 17 meters wide, and 11 meters high. A later addition into the structure is the concrete porti cocheri. On December 12, 2009, a new wooden altar piece or retablo was installed through the initiative of a parish construction committee led by parish priest Father Ted Valencia. A new altar and lectern was also commissioned to match the new altar piece. Mula naman dito sa Makabebe, Pampanga, lilihis muna ng landas ang butike papuntang Nueva Ecija next week. Papasyalan ko naman ang makasaysayang simbahan doon sa Gapan City, ang National Shrine of La Virgin Divina Pastora o mas kilala sa pangalan na Three Kings Parish. Abangan niyo ako doon guys! Bye-bye!